Hey guys, Julie here. I'm with Ballard, six month old mini Bernadoodle at the end of his program. He graduates in just a couple of days. Um, and actually today is his three week mark, but his training was extended just a little bit to accommodate his owner's vacation. So really he could go home at any day and he is set for life. Let me just show you a couple of his skills. First, I have him out on an off leash heel. The long line is dragging for safety, but I'm not giving him any guidance with the leash. So his only job is to follow my left leg and he's doing amazing at it. Now, of course, I have my e-collar here. If he starts to stray to the left, lag behind or push forward, I can always correct on my e-collar and because of the training and because of the knowledge that we've given him, he knows what to do with that information. Now notice I just turned and he turned with me. He's following me, not the other way around. Let's practice some stationary commands. Sit, good job. And I'm gonna flip the camera around for you guys. Down, very nice job. Right into that double down. I don't know if you guys can see the state of mind that he's in, but it's not a wiggly, excited, ready to pounce at any second down. He's relaxed. He understands we're working, we're on a walk, we're not on the hiking trail. And this is the state of mind he should carry when he's working in those commands. Now, to proof in, to proof in, to strengthen your downstay, your dog's downstay, you're just gonna put them in the command and then add distance, add time, which duration, and add distractions. Throw a ball by, crouch down and baby talk. Correct him when he makes the mistake, put him back in the down and repeat. This is how we get dogs who don't break their command no matter what. So in the downstay, he can stay there as long as needed. You can use it anywhere. Restaurant patio, backseat of the car, vet waiting room, grooming waiting room, kitchen floor. Let's try a tone recall. Okay, so I'm gonna tap this tone button here and he understands that means come to the person, okay? So watch this. Good boy, sit, nice job. And he comes and sits. And then from here, I can tell him to down, I could turn and tell him to heal, or I could release him. Break, break, good job. Now he's free to go sniff, go potty, If I feel like he's done with that, I can recall him back to a heel, heel, and we walk home. Amazing for a six month old dog. You can walk anywhere with him like this. There's no pulling. Not only is there no pulling, I don't even have a leash. So everything is off leash. Everything is e-collar based. Tap my tone. So he started to get distracted, who knows by what. Tap my tone and it gets him right back into place. Isn't that amazing? So as we're walking back home, I hope you can see the amazing foundation that we've set for this dog. The owner's gonna go home and continue it. I'm really happy uh, with his progress. I'm really excited for his owner to take him home and use this stuff. I know she wanted a dog she could take anywhere such an amazing feeling to walk a dog like this. So what we're gonna do now is go in and end it with putting him on the place bed. Really nice way to end your walks. Good habit to get into instead of just walking in, unclipping the leash and letting your dog go free. You're gonna wanna come in, put him on the place bed and let him relax and decompress. Place, good job. And that's the end of our walk.